Fox Glove is yours now. We'll take good care of her. I feel bad for him. I feel bad for Charlie. <laughs> feel good for us. You're not gonna believe this. Charlie is outside cutting the grass. What? Did you just get this out of the garage? That's where I keep it. Thought you'd be gone by now. Dennis is obviously a consummate professional, but he's also incredibly present acting. There's very few actors I've ever acted with that seem so present that there's magic in their eyes. And when Dion calls action, Dennis just subtly changes in terms of physicality. You can tell he goes to a different place, but he's right exactly there as Charlie Peck. And there's something terrifying about that, something exciting about that, and something that draws you in if you will allow yourself to be present as well. You just bought the Peck house, right? Yeah. Charlie's quite a guy. Just don't look too close under the mask. His wife died in that house. Mrs. Charlie took Mr. Charlie's shotgun in her mouth. At least that's how Charlie explained it. So Michael and I have a bit of history in acting together, so I knew that we'd have a great dynamic on screen. Um, mainly for me was listening to Michael, how he was going to present Scott, his character, and how to play against that. So if Scott's going to be a little bit more refined, a little bit confident, knows what he's doing in his world, but maybe a little bit more, a little bit more hesitant as a person, I thought my job would be a little bit looser, a little more gregarious, um, a little more outgoing, so we would complement each other. Uh, it's easy for us to play, and I just think that a lot of people are attracted to people who are like-minded, but that are, you know, it's like a little bit of the opposite, you know, something that would complement. The man acts like the house still belongs oh to him. I mean, he's lonely. <laughs> he's doing a classic thriller a real homage to the throwback of the classic style of thriller. And I mean back from the 50s through the 80s to today. That he's taken certain specific elements that have worked consistently, constantly, made them true, which is his stamp, truth, which is what I appreciate. And I think the audience is gonna be in for that ride. It's gonna grab them, it's gonna suck them in, and the scare is gonna be real because they're gonna be saying, that could happen to me. So it's very present. And I think that that's transcendent. I've seen the way that he looks at you. Now Charlie is after me. Stay away from my wife. <laughs>